Hey guys, welcome back to Thunderdome Homestead. I'm sure everybody watching this video can agree that they're feeling a certain amount of pinch from the grocery store these days. That being said, when you're making meals, are you getting creative? How often do you throw away leftovers? How often do your leftovers go to waste? So, sometimes when I make meals, or we make meals in our household, sometimes we'll freeze dry them, sometimes uh, we'll can them, sometimes, you know, it, it depends on what it is. If it's chili, we'll can it. If it's, you know, steaks or something, that's, you know, it depends on what it is, we can freeze dry that. But, when it comes to certain things you can just make another meal out of it so our family has something we have affectionately called slop uh it all started i was telling i, I used to make up bedtime stories for the kids and i came up with this one with the pig and slay i'm not going to i'm not going to delve into it but basically um, you feed a pig slop, right? And what is slop? It is a bunch of just random stuff thrown together, scraps. And so I ended up just taking some random stuff off the pantry. I think the first time it was uh, some ground beef, pasta, Alfredo sauce, uh, Carrots and peas and that's what we called slop. It was just a bunch of stuff thrown together, right? Well, that has evolved over time to 63 different carnations of Slop uh, this most recent one I made uh, I smoked some uh, Cornish hens and There was a bunch of leftovers. So I took all the meat off pulled all the meat off Cornish hens I had uh, green beans out of the garden with some beef bacon shredded up in it. I took all of that that was left over because a lot of times leftovers really just don't get touched in this house unless, you know, without pulling teeth, you know. So I, uh, I took all that, I threw it together, I threw some Alfredo in there, I threw some pasta in there, and there's another incarnation of slop. You have your chicken your vegetables, your sauce, and your pasta. And I've even done things like, you know, say for example, if I've made rice, I'll throw uh, I'll throw some gravy in with it, I'll take some shredded chicken, I'll do that, and I'll just throw stuff in a little pot in the freezer. And I'll take this little container, and I'll throw leftovers in there. Ooh, that sounds like it'll go good with this. This sounds like it'll go with good with that. And I'll mix it together. And I'll make a second meal out of the leftovers that otherwise would have had to have been stored or wasted. So that's another thing too, guys. If, if you're throwing food away that's getting wasted, find other ways to use it. Get creative with your meal planning. Because that could be the difference between you eating at some point and not. Anyhow, guys, hopefully you guys got something out of this. If you did, hit that like button. If you're not subscribed already, do it, dude. Come on. It's worth it. And uh, we'll talk to you guys later.